Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name's Ashley, for those of you who are new here, for those of you who aren't, hi, thanks for joining me once again. Today's video is another one in the anti-MLM series. I'm really excited to keep filming these videos. I really enjoy making this type of content and I hope you guys are enjoying this too. I have got my windows open because it's very, very warm, literally. I am sweating and I've got my lights on, so yeah. I'm sorry that if you can hear any road noise, anything like that, um, but I am really hot. There isn't really much of a breeze coming through, to be honest, so it's not really helping, but that's fine. It is what it is. And I'm just going to move you guys up slightly because I'm really slouched down. I want to set up a bit more, so I'm just going to move you guys up. That's a bit better. Um, so if you guys are enjoying this content, I have got a playlist that I'll link down below for you so you can watch all of my kind of MLM videos. I've got some from like... I did two, I think, last year when I was kind of trying to get back into YouTube again. Um, but yeah, now we've moved into our flat. I'm trying to be more consistent with filming. I'm going to try and film two or three or maybe four videos today if I can. Maybe one tomorrow is the weekend. I'll pass at work. I try to film as much as I can. But he finishes work in like an hour and a half. So I'm like, mm, <laughs> how much am I going to get done? Um, but we'll see. So today's video is a follow on from a video I did a few weeks ago, which was about Vicky Patterson. Um, if you guys haven't seen that, go and link it, link it down below. You should go and watch that one first. Um, I've since done one on Fern McCann. I'm going to do a follow up on that one as well. Um, and then there's another celebrity for me to do one on, which I do mention in the Fern McCann video. So if you haven't seen that one as well, which will hopefully be up before this one, then I will link that for you too. Um, oh, I'm so warm. So this video, as I said, is a follow on from the video about Vicky Patterson. In that video, I stated that I couldn't find a compensation plan, which I have since found. It's a little bit confusing, so we're going to run through it together. Um, I expected it to be like in a table of like how you rank up and things like that, but it's not. It's really quite weirdly laid out. So I'm going to take give you like my take on it and what I understand from the pictures. If I'm not 100% correct, I'm really sorry. And if anybody is in the company or has worked with the company or knows anything else or depicts it differently, please do let me know in the comments because I stand to be corrected. You know, if I'm wrong, let me know. <laughs> but yeah, I thought we would go through it together. So I'm just going to get it up on my iPad. Um, but yeah, if you guys do like this kind of content, please do give me a subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And a big thumbs up just so that I know that you are liking this content. If anybody else does know of anyone, um, celebrity, influencer, public figure, anyone like that that is in MLMs, please do let me know. If yourself, you yourself has been in one or involved in one and you could give me your own story, please feel free to DM me on Instagram, which is always in my bio, in my bio, in my description. And my business email as well, if you want to send it via that. If you want me to keep you anonymous, that's absolutely fine. Just let me know. Um, but I'd love to share some like real life stories, if that makes sense. So let's have a little look. Okay, so this compensation plan is for Planet Marketing. Now, Planet Marketing, I believe, owns IntelliTravel. And this is the only compensation plan I could find. So we're going to go with this. Um, I will... Like I said, I will leave it on the screen. This also has the income disclosure statement at the bottom. And this is the compensation plan for the UK. I'm going to screenshot this as well um, so that we do have it in order. It is a bit odd because it says it's for the UK, but it's all in dollars mostly. Um, so I will go through it with you. I'm going to move to the side um, so I can put it on the screen for you guys right here somewhere like that I'm fancy editing <laughs> so it says compensation plan for the uk planet marketing offers a number of ways to generate income recognition take a look at this exciting compensation plan exciting exciting would be just getting paid what you're like working like getting paid a, a salary for what you do that would be great so first let's define some terms this is where it gets confusing because it goes into like bits after this term uh, after these terms but we're going to run through it see if you guys understand it we'll see if i can figure it out so we've got the first line is rep so a rep is a person who enrolls with planet marketing for 14 pounds initial fee and 14 pound monthly there's a little asterisk which is there an asterisk anywhere there's no asterisk oh please note that all figures are based on amounts in US dollars and subject to change without notice based on current conversion rates. So the £14 a monthly is based on the dollar as well. So if the if the um, exchange rates change, that may change, I think is what they're saying. 
Um, so for the rep, £14 initial fee and £14 monthly. No commissions are paid on this initial or monthly recurring admin fee. So obviously you pay your £14 initially and then £14 monthly, which obviously on which you don't get the fee. So I'm assuming the upline, um, if they recruit you and you're paying your £14 fee, they don't get any commissions off that £14. I think is essentially what it's saying there. ITA sale. I don't know what ITA is oh here we go it does say intelli travel here a planet a planet rep sells the intelli travel ita travel agency for 142 pounds plus 32 pounds monthly this is a commissionable product sale so that is the one that vicky promotes so she mentioned 142 pound startup fee and 32 pound monthly i believe in their video or emily mentioned it in their video um so i don't know if they just bypass the rep stage and go to the ITA sale. Um, but yeah, that's a lot of money. That's 142 pounds plus 32 monthly, which is, we did work it out before, but. So 32 times 11 is 352 pounds. And then you add the 142, which means you're already paying 494 in your first year. So that's before making any commission and getting any money back. Um, so then that's the ITA sale. Then Active ITA is an Intelli Travel ITA who's paying £32 monthly. So that's the person who is paying that. That's basically what it means. It's not, that's, this isn't different ranks. This is just what the terms mean and what they're about to say, essentially. Selling rep is the planet rep who makes the ITA sale, which is when they sell the business for the £142 startup and £32 monthly. So for example... Emily was the selling rep to Vicky when she joined up underneath her, I believe. Um, I believe Vicky's underneath her, but we'll just do it like that. Um, a sponsor is a rep who enrolls another rep. A gold builder is a rep who has nine or more active ITAs, which is somebody who is within the business paying their £32 a month. And a director is a gold builder who has 100 or more active ITA in three or more legs, no more than one third in any one leg. I, I don't know what that means. I believe that in um, some multi-level marketing companies, you can put people below you in different segments, essentially, which is what the legs are. So Vicky could put her mum in this leg, her boyfriend in this leg, and her friend in this leg, and then they're accruing underneath. So they have these three streams, if that makes sense. I don't know why they do that, but they can do that. Um, but yeah, so it goes from a rep with nine or more, a gold builder who is a rep with nine or more active ITAs to a director with a hundred or more. That's a big jump, isn't it? So direct sales commission to the selling rep. When you, as a planet marketing rep, sell the in IntelliTravel independent travel agency business, an ITA sale for £142 and £32 monthly, you are paid a direct sales commission of £35. There is no limit to the number of £35 direct sales commissions you may earn paid weekly. So when Emily recruited Vicky and Vicky paid the £142 startup cost and then the £32 monthly, Emily made £35. So just recruiting one person, she just about covers her monthly cost. You have to be recruiting at least two people a month to make it that you're actually really making any money because you're only earning three pounds back essentially if you recruit one person. Forgetting the one hundred and forty-two initial startup fee, you're paying thirty-two pound a month. Like that is silly to me. Direct sales fifty percent match to the sponsor. When you enrol someone as a planet marketing rep and they make an ITA sale, which is um, selling the business for the £142 and £32 monthly, as their sponsor, you are paid a 50% match on their ITA sales. So <laughs> Emily recruited Vicky. Vicky paid £142 and £32 monthly. She, Emily, received that £35. Her upline received £18 as a bonus for Emily recruiting Vicky. Now, when Vicky made her first recruit, paying £142 start up and £32 monthly, Vicky got £35 back and Emily got £18. So this is again showing if you've got a downline, you can make money without doing much. Vicky is probably going to have quite a big downline as she's Vicky Patterson and everyone below her who recruits anyone, Vicky's getting £18 for that and that person's obviously getting their £35. Gold Builder Bonus. 
A £7 gold builder bonus is paid to the first upline gold builder for every ITA sale made in their downline down to the next gold builder. A gold builder is a rep who has made at least nine ITA sales and which sales are active ITAs paid weekly. So, as we said, a gold builder is a rep who has nine or more active ITAs in their downline. So, Vicky, it probably would be a gold builder, at least. She's probably a director, but a gold builder, so she has at least nine people below her. She is, say she is her gold, she's the gold builder. Anyone in the downline who makes the ITA sale, so again, recruiting someone, they pay the £142 and £32. That person who's made the sale, let's say she's five down from Vicky, she's made £35. The next five up from her have made £18, including Vicky's got £18, plus the £7 gold builder bonus. If no one in the five below her has is also a gold builder. So if there's 10 people below Vicky and none of them are gold builders, the 10th person gets it, Vicky will get the gold builder bonus. So there's 10 people below Vicky, but the fifth person is a gold builder. The person at number one makes that sale, the fifth person will get the seven pound gold builder bonus. Anyone from five to 10, Vicky would get the bonus. If that makes sense, I don't really know. It makes sense to me, but am I explaining it well? I don't know. Um, but basically, yeah. So it's paid to the first upline gold builder. So I am the bottom of the line. I make the ITA sale. I get my £35. My upline gets £18. Their upline gets £18. Their upline gets £18, I believe. I believe that's how it works. It may just be I get my £35 and my direct upline gets 15, um, £18. Then my upline is not a gold builder person above her they are not a gold builder person above them not a gold builder we keep going until we get to that gold builder who gets to seven pounds monthly matrix payout to selling rep a monthly bonus of three pounds is paid to the selling rep on each monthly 32 pound payment made by active itas in their matrix based on the qualification level of the rep that makes no sense. But basically, I think what it's saying is if you um, sell the business, so the £142 and £32 um, a month, you get a monthly bonus of £3. I'm not sure if that applies to everyone. It says based on the qualification level, so we don't know who that applies to. Plus, a gold builder is paid a 10% match on the monthly matrix earning of his or her nine or more directly sponsored reps. So the gold builders, they have nine. They have nine. I have to have at least nine in their downline to be a gold builder. They make a ten percent match of the bonuses of those nine people. So if those nine people have recruited one person each, they're getting that three pounds monthly bonus. That's three pounds, um, which out <laughs> three pounds for nine people is twenty seven pounds. That um, gold builder gets ten percent of that, so two pounds seventy. That makes sense. Director bonuses. Planet Marketing guarantees that when a rep becomes a one-star director, Planet Marketing guarantees that when a rep becomes a one-star director, their monthly income from all sources will be at least seven hundred pounds. What? I mean, what does it take to become a one-star director? It doesn't say. Um, well, it, obviously, one-star director is some a director is someone who has at least a hundred people in their downline. So, one-star director, you have to have a hundred people in your downline. To get 100 people in your downline is a lot of work and you're guaranteed £700. It's not worth it. Directors, one star through five star, can earn an amount of up to £35 for each ITA sale made in the downline. So yeah, so if you're a director, one star to five star, anyone in your downline makes an ITA sale to recruit someone, you can get up to £35 for each of those. If you've got 100 people in your downline, say even 50% of them, recruit one person so 50 people recruit one person so 50 people in your downline recruit one person you can get up to 35 pound back from that you'd be getting 1750 pounds for everyone else's work do you know how crazy that is <laughs> 
Directors are paid a director monthly bonus based on the number of active ITAs in their downline. Then we go into a chart which shows you the director bonus that the ITAs receive um, for their downline. So the one star director have 100 members below them, so 100 people in their downline. I don't know how anybody can achieve this plan, to be honest. We'll go through it, but you'll see it on the screen. So one star director has 100 members. Their monthly bonus is £350. Two star director has 300 in their downline. Their monthly bonus is £700. Three star director is 500 members below them, monthly bonus of £1,400. Four star director is 1,500 people below you. And that's 3,500 monthly. Five star director, that's 4,000 people under you. That's a 7,000 monthly bonus. Six star director, 10,000 people in your downline. Who has that? 11,200 a month. Seven star director, 25,000 people below you. Monthly bonus of 21,000. Eight star director, 50,000 people below you, £35,000 a month. Nine star director, 100,000 people below you, 70,000 monthly bonus. Now bear in mind, this isn't just 100,000 people that you and your downline has recruited. They all have to be active paying their £32 a month. Is that not just ridiculous? That's £32,000 being paid in just monthly bonuses for you to get your 70000 Do I just say that right? I just said something completely wrong. What I meant to say was £32 a month paid by 100,000 people. It's 3.2 million going into the company a month. Is that that sinking? A month to the business, not to anyone else. 32,000, 3.2 million a month for your 32 pound for 100,000 people below you and you get paid 70,000. Just in your bonus though, because if you think everyone's upline has got to get paid the 18 pounds, so that comes out a bit, but that's still a whole chunk of money going to Planet Marketing, just people recruiting. The active number of ITAs must be at least three legs with no more than a third of the total from any one leg. Additional director bonuses and recognition. When a rep achieves five star director, which was the 4,000 active members, 7,000 a month, they are awarded a gold Rolex watch <laughs> and must remain qualified as five star director, earning five star pay for a minimum of 60 days to qualify must remain qualified at five star director until the Rolex is awarded. So you, once you achieve it, you've got to maintain it for two months before you can get given the gold Rolex watch. Who's hitting that? Who's getting 4,000 people below them and keeping them active? A presidential ring is awarded to a one star director and above when the following qualifications are met. A presidential ring is awarded based on two con consecutive 30-day qualifying income periods followed by one 30-day maintenance period. Basically, three 30-day continuous periods. Must remain qualified until ring is awarded. So you've got to do three months at one star director. And you've got to maintain it until you receive that ring. I don't know what presidential ring is, but okay. Um... Total income for each 30-day qualifying period and 30-day maintenance period is a cumulative total of income received from weekly commissions, matrix commissions and director pay. For each 30-day qualifying income period and the following 30-day maintenance period, the minimum income requirement is as follows. Sapphire ring. Minimum income for each period of eight thousand three hundred thirty-three dollars on annual track of one hundred thousand. Ruby ring, minimum income for each period of 20,833 on annual track of 250,000. This is per month, by the way, these minimum income periods. Diamond ring, minimum income for each period, $41,667 on annual track of 500,000. Double diamond ring, minimum income for each period of $83,333 on annual track for 1 million. 
Rings are considered awards and will be presented at convention. They have a convention. Unless otherwise noticed, noted, qualifications for all awards, including rings, must be met and held until presentation. If qualification is lost before presentation, the ring will not be awarded. So, say convention is in July. You hit that rank in January. You have to maintain it for the three months to even qualify, which is then April, let's say. Then you've got to maintain it till July, to the convention, to even get it. You could maintain it till June and then drop a rank and then you're not getting your ring. I believe it's a natural ring, but who's actually hitting that? So that is everything that is on there, which... It just baffles me. Like, how is anyone achieving this? I do wonder how many people Vicky has in her downline. Um, let me see if her um, page says anything. Vicky's vacays. It doesn't say what her rank is in her um, Instagram, but I would very much be interested to know what her rank is. I know that Fern McCanns says it in her bio. I think it's like 15 star, 15 star diamond or something like that. Um, but Vicky doesn't, so I'd be curious how many people she has under her, but yeah, that is interesting, to say the least. Um, like I said, I will link the, um, I also, sorry, <laughs> I will share a link as well to where I got my source from, it's literally from the Planet Marketing website, I'll share that below, obviously all the images will be on the screen for you as well. Um, I will link the previous video I did about Vicky. In that video, someone commented saying they're actually part of the business. If you would be happy to share your story with me and you're seeing this video, please send me your story. I'd really like to hear it. Even if you don't want me to um, read it out on YouTube, that's absolutely fine. Just for my own knowledge would be great. Um, but if you are happy for me to share it, even better. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Let me know what other answer MLM content you'd like to see. I think I might just start doing like weekly, like, um, like stories and things that I've seen or posts and it's like kind of um top fails I guess I might start doing those I do have a couple more planned videos to come on this series um but yeah I hope you guys like this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below go and follow me on Instagram all of that fun stuff and I will see you guys really soon